I mean, I, I, I started Quirk without a plan. I um, just needed to run my own business. Yeah. I'm fairly unemployable. Uh, I think what was hard about it was that I was 20. I had a ginger ponytail and I didn't know what I was doing. <laughs> um, I was, went into an industry about five years before there was actually an industry. Yeah. Which, when the industry came around, we were very well placed. But I don't want to claim that as strategic brilliance. Mm. <laughs> if it had, if, if actually, it, it all tipped on Facebook. When Facebook launched in South Africa, suddenly the internet was a real thing. Yeah. My granny was on the internet and therefore people used the internet. And all the corporates that I had tried to convince that we could do great internet marketing things for them and they had basically told me, no, that seems a waste of money, three years before, suddenly all phoned back and then life got a lot easier. So it was quite a lot of struggle early on. Huge, because. huge. We had no money. And I'm very lucky that I had a business partner, Craig Raw, who, like me, prioritized the fun and freedom and flexibility and just awesome adventure of running our own business way above making money. Yeah. And so we were quite happy to be poor. Happy is a strong word, <laughs> but we were, we were fine with it.